don't. That's a Dory impression. Whoa. <laughs> I'm speaking whale. Hello. World. <laughs> You're a whale? I know whale. <laughs> Look how red my face is. Jeez. We were just outside filming for our business channel, YouTube channel. And it's not super hot, but I felt really hot because we were just sitting out there trying to do our video. Let me tell you something. Doing videos that are not vlogging is different. It's tough. I know a whale. Oh gosh. I'm on to new different things now. But I know a whale. Oh gosh. Anyways. Yeah, it's totally different. Like, I can just talk to you guys and be like, hey, what's up? This is what we're doing. What are you doing? Tell me what you're doing. Like, it's casual. So, to do like a informational video for people, like, it's fun. But it's so different because like your demeanor is different and you have a script whereas vlogging there's no script involved so <laughs> it's different but i'm excited because we're going to cover a lot of great topics we're starting with a dating series and i hope you guys check it out links to that will be in the description so right now we're deciding where should we should go out on a date and <laughs> that's always the struggle because Today is kind of like an impromptu date. It's not like a, hey, we had planned to go out on a date on this time at this place, which you should do because it helps so much more to alleviate the stress of it. But today, since we were talking about it and filling out our script for our dating series, that we just like, well, since we're in the topic of dating, let's actually go on a date. So, yeah. Here's a question. What's your question? When was the last someone on Facebook? poked you <laughs> I actually have had a lot of people poke me at so it's still alive why is she poking me <laughs> it's crazy because people like to poke it's not a physical poke it's not flirtatious I don't know I don't know all right guys you'll know when we know <laughs> where we're going out on, on a date so first we're going to T-Mobile because we've been wanting to switch plans and we're gonna ask some questions before we make that decision. Great, so we got our information from T-Mobile. So we still haven't decided where we wanted to eat, but at least we got our questions <coughs> from T-Mobile. We're switching over to T-Mobile for sure. We just don't know exactly when. The problem is tomorrow is the pre-order for the new iPhone, which I want. And if I just go pre-order with T-Mobile, then I have to wait a week to get it. And then not only that, but they would port everything over for my mom, John, and my sister's line, but not for me. So I would be deferred and I'd be paying on AT&T and T-Mobile at the same time. So it's kind of hectic to go that way. So we were thinking, we can get the free phones that they offer and then get the phone through Apple themselves and then we could just switch the SIM card. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. And they go live at midnight tonight. So I think I'm gonna do that. And that way we pay less because then I won't have to pay an upcharge because they were saying putting 120 up front for the phone. Wait, Apple, I don't have to do that. And John's saying that he thinks that Apple Care comes with it. It does. So I think that's the best bet. We are here at Fresh Cat. We decided to get some yummy Look at seafood. Look there's an ice cream place here. Flannel Cow Creamery. Homemade ice cream and frozen treats. Ooh. Maybe. 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 <laughs> Why is it called flannel though? Because oh. they made them fabric. <laughs> they put their cows in flannels. That's how they make sure they have good ice cream. Oh, I smell Asian. Oh, because Kwan's kitchen's over there. I'm like, what's that Asian smell? This is a seafood place. <laughs> All right, time to get our seafood on. Tummy full, babe. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ugh. My tummy's full. We both had the same thing except I had baked fish. John had fried fish, the bad boy over there. What? <laughs> hey, as long as you enjoyed it. I enjoyed you're not, it. You're not the one on the diet, I am, so. Hey, every now and then I can have something fried. I don't have it often. Yeah, but I didn't want double fried because I had fries on the side, so. Which was very filling, and we only ate once today. We had a waffle, waffle, uh, yeah, waffle. with some uh, egg and strawberries and strawberries and, and bananas and, uh, and whipped cream. So that was a treat, and that was it. Cause we woke up late today. We slept until almost ten, <laughs> and didn't get out of bed till like eleven. <laughs> but it's our day off, so we can <coughs> do that. Cause we never sleep in that late. So we woke up and John did some, well John made the breakfast and he put some of the dishes away um, and then I was editing yesterday's vlog and then I, we were writing our script for our videos for the business channel and then we filmed one of those. So pretty uh, busy day and now it's about it's 6.20 we were talking about the iPhone still. John's not sure if he wants to get the iPhone. What is your predicament? Well, I don't want to spend the money. It's always about money with him, which, you know, obviously we have to be good stewards of our money and spend it right and not just, you know, go on a shopping spree and all that kind of stuff. But we did fit it into our budget and with the new plan at T-Mobile, we're actually gonna be saving money. So it's gonna be going down a lot. So I think he's okay with getting it, um, regardless of our budget. Like, it fits in our budget. So he's just being a pooper scooper. I think he's just not completely satisfied with the iPhone yet. I'm hoping that the battery on the iPhone 7 is great, because I that's what I need is the battery. And I know iPhone 7 Plus is got a better battery. But number one, the iPhone 7 is cheaper. Number two, I like the size. I like the ability to control the phone with one hand. I think the 5 inch phone is, 5.5 inch phone is huge. Especially the way Apple makes it. I think it's just huge. So I want a smaller phone, but my pet peeve also is that they put smaller batteries into smaller phones as long as small specs mind you but it's not going to be producing the amount of uh, energy that it needs because no. they made these to have like the better camera true and, and that's the other thing more like, power why if you want high specs do you have to get a phone that's almost six inches like Small phones can't be the best phone too. You can't put like all the But they the best. created it that way. I'm just saying like, you're forcing people to, if they want the best phone, they have to be like everyone else and get the size, the biggest size. I just want a small phone, not, not iPhone 5 small. I want a good phone for that price with a great battery. Well, I'm gonna leave the ball in his park because I can never make a decision for when it comes to phones. I, I can never make a decision for him because he's always unsatisfied. Think I might be okay with the iPhone 7, 7 battery. I think I might love the iPhone 7. But, 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 a but, 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 like I said, I'm leaving that up to you. But for me, I already have my mind set up. I am getting the iPhone. We made it to Redbox in our friendly neighborhood cumbies. So we're gonna pick two movies because we both have a Redbox code. It's familiar, but I can't he remember. Was a secret, he works in the White House and he had to protect the president. Oh, but this is about London? Yeah, it's about London. I guess. What else is there? Oh, he's there too. Or you want, now you see me. I don't know. Comedy. Such a hard choice. Was there a comedy? Bronze is a comedy. Oh. So the red box we were at got frozen. We couldn't use our code. We're gonna try another red box and see if it'll take my code. Hopefully that's the case. If not, I'm gonna message red box. Guys, it works. All right, John's turn. Woohoo! 
nice date. Home before night. Well, home before dark falls. <laughs> this is Johnny Boy behind me. We got two action-packed movies from Redbox. We got Now You Can See Me Part 2 and Allegiant, which is the third part of the Divergent series. You know what would be pretty cool? What? If now you don't see me, they have... Uh, what? Oh, now you do it? see me? No, the, <laughs> the, the wrestler there. The you rock? can't see me. Which wrestler is that? The, Don Cena. He says that? Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. There's daddy getting his daughter all riled up. Hannah, we home! Hi! Are you excited? <laughs> John always likes to do that to all dogs. <laughs> Get them all roused up. We were gonna stop at that flannel ice cream place near the restaurant, but. The flannel ice cream place. You know, like they have ice cream and they wrap it in like a flannel cone. <laughs> so it's like. <laughs> but then we were like, eh, we have ice cream at home, why spend more money? But we did good because that was like a really expensive seafood restaurant and like their plates average about twenty, twenty-five, even thirty dollars. So we actually only spent twenty-seven because we got uh three nine dollar plates. So me and John both got the haddock fish sandwich with fries and then we got coconut shrimp as an appetizer so we did good in our spending wise especially for a place like that and she already ate her ice cream for today but i haven't so mm. i'm gonna eat that's um, why i like eating ice cream with you so i don't feel left out even though i had it give me a box he wants the movies all right i'm getting them i'm getting oh, it's them. Already seven. all right time to watch our movies and i'll let you know how they were we just finished both movies it's almost midnight and i liked both movies but i liked now you see me now you see me is it i forgot anyways i liked both movies but i liked now you see me better just because there's like an element of surprise and mystery and i like that kind of thing because you're like oh wait how did that happen oh wow you know like how everything ties in and stuff whereas allegiant was more of like a book series that was taking place after the other movie and i don't know i, I don't like how they did it it was kind of like done fast like they were here in this moment and then they went to another place and then they went back. It was just like weird. So, I mean, I know there's a lot of haters out there that don't like the Divergent series. And now I hear for the last movie, it's coming to television. So they're not even going to do like a big production film in Hollywood and the theaters. It's just going to be on TV. So I guess they didn't do so well in getting their money. I don't know what John's opinion is on the movies because... Part of the movie, we were so annoyed by a cricket that was just chirping, chirping, chirping. There was like several in our bulkhead. We got a couple, but one we think is in our ceiling. I don't know how that's possible because crickets can't fly. So yeah, we haven't found it and I hope it doesn't land in my bedroom because that's where they end up sometimes. Um, but we always have a bug issue. Every time you watch the vlogs, you're like, what's up with these people and their bug issues? Fly infestation, huge spider in the kitchen crickets in our bulkhead i mean <laughs> what other bug we're gonna find next really anyways enough of that bug drama we're headed to bed now it's almost midnight so i'm gonna check for the pre-order of the iphone and see if i can get it online because i was saying something about if you go to t-mobile you have to get it in store i don't know what that's all about but i'm gonna check it out and see if i can get it but we're gonna end the vlog here i'll let you know more tomorrow i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog please give it a thumbs up if you did. We really, really appreciate it and we're so thankful for each and every one of you that watch. If it's your first time here and you enjoyed this vlog and want to see more, then hit that subscribe button. You'll get notified every time we upload, which is now a new upload schedule. I failed to say that in the last video, but our new upload schedule is going to be Monday through Friday. So we're gonna take the weekends off and it's gonna be better since we're working on the business you and we're gonna be doing once a week on that channel hope you guys have a great day remember to love your life and we'll see ya manana bye Let it, be under. it went fast I see it. you see it